Our Place is about people and services working together to transform their neighbourhood. In this film, those involved in Our Place New Wortley tell you about how their strong partnership benefits the 1,500 residents of this part of Leeds. A lot of the problems that present to me are not medically, not absolutely medically related. It's a lot of social deprivation, for example. It's not uncommon for me to see a patient that literally just comes in to tell me that they've got no money at all. But the Our Place project has helped with that because what we can do is we can say, OK, why don't you go over to the community centre and see if they can help you? And they will get some help with literacy and numeracy skills. They will speak to somebody who can help with their work enablement, might be able to help to write them a CV, might be able to help with their, with their mental... Because often it's maybe not mental health problems, but it may well just be um, poor self-esteem and not sufficient confidence in, in order to put them to the next level. It's all about um, helping people um, reach their goal. So then, like, he was happy and then he started volunteering. He, he helps with the laundry, he helps with the reception as well. We have, a, like, a regular volunteering day and people come in and um, sometimes we're just doing jobs around the community centre. So, um, <laughs> we've been painting the hall, <laughs> for example. Uh, with the recent floods, um, the volunteers went out and helped sort of um, flood clear up stuff for a couple of weeks. So that was, like, shifting sandbags and things like this. Uh, it enables people People never feel happy about getting something for nothing and people always want to have the opportunity to put something back so that's, that's why we do it in this way and it um, enables people to sort of share and take part. Before I actually um, um, was offered employment here I, I, I worked as a volunteer which I thoroughly um, enjoyed. Um, Gary the manager gave me a chance. I turned up, I was reliable. Um, and I did a number of tasks. I did the gardening, um, I helped out in the kitchens, um, did some cleaning, and it was just the right number of things worked in a laundry. And basically, um, um, I ended, ended up becoming a key holder as well. So that was fine. And um, um, so eventually, after three, four years, I got a job as well out of it. So. We affect people's lives a bit like a ladder. It starts with coming through the door, hopefully, it graduates to volunteering. That volunteering becomes taking responsibility and then eventually we hope that people will be in such a state of confidence in their own abilities that they will be placed within employment and we have been successful in doing that with quite a number of people who have been unemployed and considered unemployable for many 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 years. The Our Place partnership in New Wortley started really with a belief that uh, the residents should be in charge. We've got a very strong residents association that meets every month um, that has a lot to do with the changes and the things that go on in the area. We spent most of the resources we were allocated from Our Place, we actually spent it on consultation, but really in-depth consultation with the local community to say we need to change the way things are done because this is the reality of what it is like to live in New Worley and that reality isn't a right way for people to live. And you had the evidence there in terms of statistics but then it was backed up with a lot of personal testimony and that encouraged services and agencies to send or to, or to get involved at a much higher level because you need the higher level people there if you're going to make them think about things like how strategically they change the way they work or they change the way they allocate their budgets. All of us have got to recognise that by ourselves and individually we're not going to solve the problems. We're only going to solve the problems if we all come together. One of the cr crucial things is getting the right people around the table and to get the right people around the table what you need to do is you've got to have local community members and you need a range of them, you can't just have one or two, you need a range of community members and then you need Ideally, you know, what we had was the local MP, the head teacher of the primary school, and we had a local GP from the medical practice who's also a board member of the clinical commissioning group. And that gave us a really strong partnership. 
So we collaborate closely with housing, police, we have the school that is next door, so we liaise with anybody who works in the school. We also have the health service next door to us, the GP practice, we have the local chemist, we have local businesses and shops, and everybody's on board. So out of the Our Place partnership with New Workley and the, the organisations involved in that, um, we created the business forum to kind of give the community an economic lift. We think there's a lot of opportunities here, provided people all get together, share the plans, share the aspirations and uh, come up with a, a plan. So that's the economic plan uh, and it's part of the, the overall Our Place initiative which we have going here. In terms of investment into the area, we've now, we can quantify three and a half million pounds of direct investment and another three and a half pound million pounds of indirect investment and that's in the first year of our place so I, I do believe there'll be more to come. New investments include 2.5 million pounds in tower block improvements from Leeds City Council, over 600,000 pounds for a new community centre funded through the National Lottery and 210,000 pounds from Power to Change to create a health and wellbeing centre. The very tangible signs of that investment is the new community building. So basically we've been working in partnership with New Workley um, for a while now to realise the, the dream of, of a new centre for them. Uh, so it's worked basically in partnership with, with the university. Uh, the students have come down, kind of uh, have 30 plus architecture students come down at various stages, work with the community design elements of that building. Uh, so the community had a real input into, into what's gone in, into that new centre. We're actually standing in the nearly completed new community centre for New Workley. And it's a very good example of the way in which this neighbourhood's really started to look up over the last few years. Since we've had sort of more support coming, we've been able to loads more to sort of realise the potential of the centre and doing the outreach and sort of and just sort of helping people and um, utilising people's skills and abilities in a more positive way. There have been a lot of changes in the lifetime of the partnership and there's certainly a lot more planned over the next few years. Some of them are easy to see because there's been some real capital investment, improvements to the tower blocks and so on. But I think some of the most important changes are the attitudes of a whole range of agencies to New Workley. So shifting from it being seen by everybody as a problem it being seen as a, an area that there's not much you can do about, to being an area where there's a, a dynamic partnership led by residents, but the agencies want to come. You know, we have partnership meetings with 30, 40 people, and the agencies are changing their attitudes and therefore changing the way they're, they're delivering services in, in New Workley.